Connecticut Sun will pay tribute to military personnel and first responders tomorrow night. The team will host the Hometown Heroes Night up at Mohegan Sun Arena. The Sun get a visit from Sue Bird, Brianna Stewart, and the Seattle Storm. Military members and first responders with an ID have a chance to take advantage of a special ticket offer. The night is special to Sun Guard Rachel Bannum. Her mom and dad are both police officers. Her grandfather was one as well. Bannum has all three of the badge numbers tattooed on her arm. She has a deep appreciation for those who serve the community. It was hard. I mean, my mom worked nights in North Minneapolis, which is really scary. It's not the best neighborhood, and I never knew when she was going to come home in the morning or if she was okay. Like, you know, I was just sleeping, which, and that was scary. And my dad did kind of the similar stuff, so it was hard, but it taught us to be tough and just to. To really appreciate my parents every single day. I got my grandpa, my dad, and my mom's badge numbers just to represent them and just always remember all the stuff that they've done. Bannum has been playing great uh, as, uh, lately as well, averaging 13 points in our last two games. The Sun and Storm tip off at 7 o'clock. Sun guard Jasmine Thomas got some good news today. She's been added to the Team USA basketball national team pool. Team USA is going to play an exhibition game September 8th at Webster Bank Arena in Bridgeport. The arena also announced today that women's NCAA tournament basketball will return to Bridgeport in 2022.